Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Casey Gibson, giving you lifestyle and everyday content. This morning, I had me an omelet with some tomato and turkey because that's all I had in my fridge. And they finally came back out with the cotton candy green grapes. Of course, I have to have my Trader Joe's no joke ginger shot. I love having these just because it goes ahead and kickstarts my day. I realized that I didn't really shake it up before I <laughs> went to open it. So I made sure to give it one little extra nice shake. This one really gets you that first hit. Oh, we're going to get started with my day. To start my morning, I like to eat some breakfast and then start watching a little bit of YouTube. I had Lauren Giraldo on this morning. If you don't know her, she's the 12, 330 girl. And I had to get rid of all of my trash. My roommate is coming back from california this weekend so i wanted to make sure that i go ahead and clean up the apartment and didn't leave a whole mess for her to come back to good morning i say that but it's already like 10 30 and i got a really late start to the day i was supposed to get up at like 6 30 i had my do not disturb on so my alarm never went off so Great way to start a happy Monday. Um, but I got home and I got all of my stuff ready. I hopped on my laptop around 9-ish this morning. I still have to do 10 hours. So 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So I won't be off till 7 p.m. tonight. Love that for me. I have to release my video episode today with miss usa so that's gonna be really fun i'm super excited i actually have not edited it i edit all of my own stuff for those who may not know i am a host of a podcast and it's called crowding moment podcast it's about pageantry and kind of what goes into it and what's the behind the scenes view of it so people don't really know that they think about toddlers and tiaras as what is pageants so this gives you a whole different look so definitely check it out you can see it on spotify as well as on youtube as well and all other podcasting platforms but right now I have to edit all of that. I am right now working. I have a few things I need to do for work. My actual job, I am a woman in STEM. So I work for an aerospace engineering company as my full time job. That's what I do and that's what's most important. And then obviously all of my pageant stuff is just an amazing hobby that I have and I'm super excited. This week I have a lot to work on. It is a very pivotal week. So it is November 28th when I started this today. And I leave for Miss America on the 14th of December. So I have roughly like 16 days to get everything in order. Um, that's getting all of my outfits packed, getting my new suitcase in, getting everything together. Because right now it is all in different places and things need to be ordered and all of my stuff needs to be put together. I do a Tuesday take with Casey tomorrow to post to the YouTube channel as well. So... Lots of moving parts, lots of things to do. I'm gonna go ahead and get started with my work today. I have my cup of coffee. Mm. I just got a new creamer and it's brown sugar flavor. I'm trying to recreate the shaken brown sugar iced espresso from Starbucks, but right now I just have hot coffee. I just have some Sumatra, so 10 out of 10. That's all my parents drink is dark black coffee, which I really like, just plain coffee. But I already had an espresso shot in there, so I just went ahead and filled it up, and so it's got a little bit of that leftover. So it tastes really good. So to not turn on that, Nature Blush really has good stuff, and it's oat milk, so it's all plant-based. Love that for me. So I'm going to get started, like I should have three minutes ago, and I'll just do a watch me while I work. Yay. Okay, so I actually just <laughs> got a notification that the things I ordered from Amazon are coming in today. I really wanted some light around the mirror in my bathroom because it's very warm lighting. But I was like, you know what, why not get fun with it? So I haven't decided if I'm actually going to put these in my bathroom yet or put them in my bedroom. This is screaming senior year COVID-19 college edition. But I got one of these like the 50 foot neon lights because my brother has them in his apartment he's a 30 year old man so if he can have them i can have them and they're just the coolest lights but i saw somebody had it like on the side of this mirror so i was like oh this will be good and it was only like 10 bucks so i was like oh yay so i ordered that and then i ordered the bloom nutrition greens and superfood packets for digestion bloating and uh immunity because one i've been a really sick gal lately that's why at the beginning of the video i just didn't talk because my nose is very stuffy and then these ones i'm waiting so i got these because i'm also waiting for the hydration uh fun on weekdays ones to drop from 
water boy i really want those packets too so then i'm gonna have one like have them both um during the day so um yeah miss jenna you need to hurry up and drop those because i really 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 want them so i'm waiting for these packages to come in they're on the way as we speak they're out for delivery so let's hope they come in today i just finished editing my miss usa podcast literally all my cords are right here because my laptop started dying everything was just falling apart like 10 minutes in so i just finished it it looks so good like i am so shocked honestly good things come to those who wait and i am someone who is not patient and this has really taught me that patience is key because i never knew that i would be able to interview miss usa and the most scandalous miss usa at that so this video is i hope it does well because it was so good the editing on it like i've never actually had to edit a side-by-side -side video before so that's really cool because all of my interviews have always just been audio they've never been video so i think this is the best one to start doing video on because this is pretty awesome um but yeah so if you want to listen or watch it check it out on my youtube at crowning moment podcast as well as all podcasting platforms at crowning moment podcast as well it'll be up monday by 5 p.m so if you're already seeing this it's probably already posted that's so awesome. Okay, now that I've done that, it's time to get a snack, eat some lunch, a little bit of both. I already ran out of grapes like five minutes in and I was so upset. I've done what I needed to do right now for work. Videos ready to be posted in like approximately 10 minutes. But I'm gonna wait because I say 5 p.m. So I'm gonna do it at 5 p.m. I indeed did not wait till 5 p.m. I immediately posted it. But everything's already done, which is kind of nice. And it was already done before noon. Yay. That's really good for me because usually it's like kicking at like 4.30 and I'm like, I don't know if I'm going to get this done or not. But the rest of my day is going to look like eating, going to the gym, and probably doing all of my laundry. I haven't unpacked for my trip last week. Um, but yeah, so I got to go do all of that and finish getting all my clothes out the dryer because I washed a bunch of clothes that I didn't take with me that were just already in my hamper so then I can wash all of my clothes for being at home. And hang everything up. That definitely needs to happen. As well as, like I said, going to the gym. I have to get that workout in today. I am, let's see, 16 days out from Miss America. And I need to make sure that I am in tip-top shape. So I have about 16 days to get my butt in gear. Even though there's nothing wrong with me right now, I just want to make sure that my legs are toned and everything's right. So I've got 16 days to make sure everything's in a good place. Switching out things in my diet day by day just because I need to. And I found out what I'm allergic to. The, or that really irritates my system. So we're going to fix that. Don't you worry. I, 10 out of 10. Let's get this day started or finished. I guess would be the best, the best way to put it. I need to pop me open like a digestive soda. Because my stomach is not good after those eggs this morning. So maybe I need to add eggs to my list of things I should not eat. I don't know. Maybe it's the coffee. I, I don't know. Something's bothering me. I don't know what. So I got to figure that out. So let's go do that. <laughs> What some people don't know is that, let's see when this was, like three years ago, I thought like I was destined to be a YouTuber. I was going to drop out of college. I was going to do the whole thing. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. And so I'm going to leave these videos up there. You can just go into my videos and find them. They're hilarious. Like I was so funny. People always think their own selves funny. I probably was just, I look stupid, but I was like on a cruise and did videos. I was in New York visiting my friends doing videos. I did spring break, week in my life, day in life, pageant queen. Very different things. They're hilarious. That Read the captions. That's the even better part. Start where we left off. <laughs> I crack myself up. Okay, so for dinner tonight, I'm having a spicy red pepper salmon with... Uh, spinach and i don't know what the other word is con 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 something whatever that is that word i do not do words very well but i mean it looks pretty gas i feel like i'm gonna have to add like a zaxby's or a zesty buffalo or even just like regular buffalo sauce to this i don't know what it's sitting in but i do know that it about busted out the container but i got it at whole foods 10 out of 10 and you get a reusable container out of it so we're going to eat this, watch some YouTube, and then I'm going to go to the gym, get my gym workout in, and a little bit of cardio. Shout out to Morgan Morgan Fitness. 
She's the best fitness woman ever. You can look her up at Morgan Morgan Bonafide on Instagram. I'm going to eat this now, and I'm going to check back with you when I get to the gym. Okay, so I ended up going to Whole Foods after the gym. The gym at my apartment complex was just, like, way too packed. So I have a membership at Planet Fitness still, and I wanted to tan anyway. So I went to Planet Fitness, which is, like, in Chapel Hill. So it's, like, not, it's like not that far from me. So I went there and did... I did a lot of running today. I just feel like it was a good cardio day. So I will jump back on my actual like workout workout tomorrow, but I just really needed to do a cardio day. But I went to Whole Foods afterwards because I had just got in um, the Bloom Nutrition like coconut packets. And I wanted to try it. So I went ahead and picked me up some OJ to try it with, but I got those from Amazon. I didn't get them from Whole Foods. And then I also got, um, some lights from Amazon. That's what I was talking about earlier today. I finally went and got them from the hub. Okay, so this is my my Whole Foods haul. I got some watermelon. These are my favorite. So I got some salmon. And I didn't when I okay, so I've already been to the grocery two different grocery stores this week. One of them was the same Whole Foods I went to today, but I didn't get any salad, and so I got the Mexican chopped salad, but I like how everything's separate so that if I don't want the cheese, I don't have to put it on there. Super awesome. I just like the salad kits. They're so much easier. And then I found these. I am a sucker for sweets. And so I wanted to try something that, like, actually is not as bad for you. I mean, it's, it's like, all sorts of, it's, like, vegan and whatnot and gluten-free, no sugar alcohol additives. There's no sugar had alcohol, but okay. There's one. Oh. Okay. We'll try the blue. And these are the Smart Sweet Sour Blast Buddies. That is so good. Wow. Look at these at 10 out of 10. Other than them being like $9, 10 out of 10. And then I got some of these Annie's Rice Christmas Treat. Rice Crispies, <laughs> Rice crispy snack bar things. They do have milk in them. But we'll see how that works. But they are gluten free. Lit. Super excited about those. And then I saw this on, on TikTok. About the cauliflower pizza. So I was like, okay, I'll try it. Also like $10. But it's whatever. Margarita pizza is my favorite. So that worked. And then these were, this is literally the only thing I went for. I went for baby carrots and I ended up with everything else. That's normally how it goes, but that's normally how when I go to Target, I had to stop going to Target for that. And then, oh my goodness, I found these. It's the spinach ravioli and they're non-dairy. I don't think they're gluten-free, but um, contains wheat and almonds. So, almonds are fine, wheat, it'll be okay. As long as it doesn't have dairy, I'm cool with it. Next. Okay, okay, okay. So these were the drinks I was talking about earlier today that I liked way better. But tonight, I'm going to do the Bloom stuff and not these so I don't ruin my system. Okay, I've had... Okay, it's Poppy. I've had the strawberry lemon... They're uh, prebiotic soda. Sorry, not digestive. Whatnot. I mean, they're good for your gut. But yes, 10 out of 10, the best flavor. Then raspberry rose. So I was like... Mm, I'll try it because I hadn't tried the other ones. I've tried the orange. I like the orange, but I didn't like any of the other flavors. So I just got this one because I wanted to get something different. And that was it. And I spent a whopping $71.40. So that's that. For the rest of the night, I'm just probably going to eat me some snacks. I'm going to do my bloom greens just to try it. I'm going to try it with OJ because I don't, I've, I've never had it before. So I just want to see it. And I got the coconut flavor. So we'll see if it's actually good or not. And then... I'm going to wind down the night, take a shower, and then go to bed. And that will be the rest of my day. It is currently 12 o'clock. And I just finished my shower. I went ahead and put the lights around my wall that I had gotten from Amazon today. Instead of around my mirror in my bathroom, I just thought they were too thin. And there was so much of it. I was like, might as well use all of it instead of just cutting half of them off. So I did that. I mean, I could have doubled them around the corner but it just wouldn't have looked great so it is time to go to bed i have my alarm set for 6 30 in the morning 
I will probably snooze it a couple times, but I know that I definitely need the extra sleep. So I'm gonna go ahead and hit the hay for today. Thank you so much for hanging out with me all day and join me on the next day in my life.